So John, how does one go about uh, configuring VMware HA for vSAN? So one thing you'll notice is when you actually turn on vSAN, you generally do it when HA is off. And the reason for that is, is when HA comes on and it sees that vSAN is in use, uh, it actually moves the heartbeat network over to the vSAN network. Um, this is a kind of weird trivia that not everyone's aware of. When you see that VM kernel where you tag it for different uses and one says management, uh, you can actually manage a host on every single VM kernel port. Um, specifically the one you tag as management, it's not like extra firewall ports open or anything necessarily there, but instead that's actually where the heartbeats go between the host. And so by uh, having tagged vSAN VM kernel ports and vSAN being online, HA when it comes on will actually move the heartbeats there. Um, the other thing to note is that sometimes you would add additional fencing, either using isolation addresses, which vSAN definitely supports. And if you can do that, please do. Um, they'll need to be on the vSAN network, obviously, um, or reachable from the vSAN broadcast domain. But the other option was data store heartbeating, where you would tag data stores that then a heartbeat file, you'd have this little HA directory, would get created on, and generally you'd try to do more than one of those. Um, and do additional fencing through the storage. That is not supported on vSAN because we're already heartbeating on the network. That's kind of superfluous in regards here. Um, if you did have external arrays, you, you could certainly still do that, but that's not you know, necessary in this environment. So um, you know, in summary, uh, the you know, use isolation addresses if you can. Uh, do note that the AHA heartbeats now happen over the vSAN network, and that makes fencing just a lot easier and how we handle things. And otherwise, HA, by the way, does have deep integrations that in vSAN know what they are. They can play nice through partitions and other things. Um, and then lastly, you don't use vSAN with data store heartbeating. It's, it's not even an option.